Okay, so we have uh, Captain Falcon versus uh, Falco. Quite an obvious play, I would say. And uh, yeah, the bounty phase is going on quite smoothly thanks to the Netplay community build. They ah, they seem to end up on Battlefield. Why the hell not? Cool. So, um, we'll see. Generally, I think uh, this matchup is quite annoying for a Captain Falcon player, but then again, all on most matchups can feel real annoying as a Captain Falcon player, so maybe it doesn't say too much. But, um, Bruce Target establishing his domi dominance right now. See if uh, Snappy can get some star. He gets the knee. Oh! Nice uh, game by uh, Slabier. Got some nice uh, jab jab. Probably was going to be an F smash somewhere there, but he died away, so we couldn't do a follow up. We have uh, one of all the viewers getting excited. And uh, we're once again one stock equal. Rooster having a little bit more uh, solid neutral game, and uh, Snabier might have to rely more on those fast kills. Oh, gets pillared by uh, Rooster. Still quite even. See if someone switches anything up or if they will continue with their uh, previous plans. Oh, gets a. Oof! Almost a hard knee there. Mm, not too certain about that edge guard attempt. He needed to have Ricardo with that side up in a very strange angle for that bear to connect. If. Uh, I'll be probably trying to uh, round up this up so he gets the equal again. Oh, and a nice uh, knee after the tech. Not sure if he read that or if he just threw out the knee for uh, good sake. Just for good measure. Uh, tries to stomp through the platform. The platform is not short enough to t uh, hit him when he's standing. Oh! Tried to anticipate to get a grab, but uh, Kevin Falcon was on the wrong side. Nice back air. I didn't get much from that grab. Oh! He's trying to go for those uh, dare to knee conversions. Going with him uppers. Get another knee. Oh! Um, get another knee by Snavier. Good one. Nice. See how much uh, percentage Snavier can build up before. Uh, Rooster might be evening up the stocks. Or if he even goes as far as taking the last stock without losing his uh, second. Ooh. And I would have suggested a forward angle F tilt there to cover the side B, but it didn't matter because he has the. So the first game goes to stop you. Ooh. Which uh, map will uh, get banned, do you think? Snabu does not want to play on. Let's see here. Okay, I guess they banned PS and took Yoshi's store or something. Uh, question is, uh, do uh, Roostog feel comfortable with the platforms here, or what's the thought? I, I see a lot of uh, Falcons go to this map. I guess uh, one of the thoughts are since their recovery is so bad, if they're gonna die outside, they, they can mi they might as well die off the blast zone instead of not being able to recover. And they always have the nice uh, down B kill on most characters, maybe not Captain Falcon. Nice back air, gets the first dog quite clean. Oh, don't chase it. Nice up smash. Oh, didn't get the follow up with the side B. Uh, Falco's uh, tech roll is really long, so if you don't read it, you're probably gonna miss whatever you were trying to do. Now we're trying to get something started. Pre-empty down till give, didn't give him too much. Crazy legs. Oh, and I think he captured him with a double jump or either he captured him with a double jump or he was really certain he would get the ledge, but it didn't happen either way. Oh, I was about to say Rooster looking really strong right now, but then he has this <laughs> once again. It's a bad trademark to be having if you want the results. Oh, nice back side B. And yet another side B. Didn't really convert, but almost. Oh, and uh, 
soft uh, dash attack. Ooh, an up smash. And a nice upper. Uh, I'm not really sure if the Shaga benefit or not there. I think it actually uh, did not benefit for Snub here. Ah, nice second hit on the Nair. Keeping on the pressure. Oof. Ooh. I think he could have connected that to any LAC F smash edge guard. Did not work. Going with some of them edge guards. That's unfortunate. I think he tried to take, but he accidentally did an air dodge instead. Ooh. And that's stun. Roostog is still in a very good position, but still getting a run for his money. He's like, uh, he's going for a lot of those uh, dares to initiate combos. I usually don't do that too much with uh, Captain Falcon, but maybe I should. This he has a variation as well, so it's not like he only dares. Not exactly sure what Rooster tried to do with that edge guard, but it worked. I don't know. Don't complain what ain't where we can, or how you put it. Uh, and yet again, the reason they are not here is because they're playing online, and I'm just spectating like a creeper. Now they're going to Pokemon Stadium, which makes me wonder... Oh yeah, they're playing best of five, I guess. So there's no uh, stage ban, that's why they didn't ban anything. My B. Update the score, so everything's all great. Chat is getting a bit uh, excited, I would say. I usually like this uh, stage with Captain Falcon. I can't really explain it with words, but I guess... I just guess the, guess the platforms are nice and it's always fun to wall jump when on the ter stage transformations. The short ceiling doesn't affect him Falcon because he so rarely dies on top anyways for instance. Oh, nice reverse back here. Yeah. I saw that uh, bear coming from miles away but it landed it. The second one, at least. Hmm. Nice uh, fade back into side B's. Seems to have been catching uh, Roostog off guard quite a lot of times. Let's see if he can increase the. Oh, yeah, not any. Increase the lead he has here. Oof. Thank you, Windmill. Nice uh, back air pressure. Really uh, getting a lot of results with his back airs, I must say. Falcon has the luxury of having uh, use for all of his aerials. Oh, nice shine juggling. Oof. Showing uh, the 20x X shenanigans. Oh, really good offensive by Rustog. A bit tricky for Snub, uh, Snub to get something started. Nice. Oh, it's Tom and the knee. The classic conversion, he did some moonwalks just because he's so awful. Nice continued pressure. Roostog is really going at it right now. I'm sure if he just wanted to bait a reaction from Snubby there, or if he just missed an input. But it looked a bit mind gamey to not do an aerials. Oh, nice knee. And yet another quite full stock lead for Snub here. Going with the laser pressure, one of the typical things that uh, makes uh, Captain Falcon's uh, <laughs> new game quite it. That's actually an interesting thing. We're playing on the Paul version, but thanks uh, to this being a patch and TSC version with the characters, he actually uh, can avoid the laser with a side B. This is uh, it's a bit uh, awkward. It shouldn't, it shouldn't be possible in PAL, but it is uh, in this version, which is supposed to be PAL, but it's really anti SC patched. Probably because. Oh, and uh, a DBC, which really benefited the Snub here. And Snub here takes the uh, second game. So. It's one game uh, from uh, kicking out this uh, Roostog from the rest of the tournament.
Uh, can see why it takes him to uh, final destination. Generally, I guess uh, Captain Falcon benefits a lot more with platforms in, the, in this uh, case. But he can do a bit more tech chase against uh, Falco on this stage. Oh, nice pillar. Oh, probably wanted to do a short hop uh, knee, but accidentally did a full hop, so he missed the punish on the dare. Getting quite the mileage from these jabs. Oof, almost got the ledge, but that was not the case. Are you getting a lead? Nice F tilt. Yeah, Parker doesn't usually have too much to say when he's recovering like that. I need to scoop him up a couple of times instead. Try to punch the get up with a there, but uh, he get the shield up instead. I think uh, it looks like Snubby is currently. It's very, it's very uh, even, but it feels like uh, Snubby is feeling himself a little better in the neutral game. But I could be wrong. Then again, even if you're good in neutral game, you if you get outside the stage with get the Falcon, it's really awkward. Uh, Russo, I guess, uh, apparently find this dire attack and realize, wait, this attack is really good. I should use it like all the time, which can be a problem. Oof. It's a lot of soft needs that could be really hard needs, which you just get, get him a stock, basically. Oh, there we have it. Currently. Rusto is still in a good position, but uh, a nice combo from Snabier, and that's kind of changed. Nice shines, two shines. Didn't get the pillar he wanted, I'm not sure if it was slow timing or DI from uh, Snabier. The lasers are really messing him up right now. He's probably trying to jump out. Oh, just a really raw F smash in the face. Ooh, nice uh, downer to a jab reset. Oh, to a knee. Oh yeah, there we go. Best scenario would be if you got a reverse knee there, but you can't have everything. Almost, uh, he's, he was really close to closing up to one stock with zero percentage there, but he let Rustog uh, survive and that's his mistake. It's like Rustog had been uh, trying to apply some more F smashes, just trying to get this over with. Seems to be paying off currently. Hasn't begun, begun too much punish for uh, raw F smashes, I would say. Yeah, that was a lazy down smash recover. Uh, protection. Ah. Oh. We have a brutal knee. Ugh. This looks really rough for uh, Snobby currently. He really needs to get something going. Okay. Oof. And a brutal F smash. Okay, so we're 1-1 one, one even now. We're at the last game to decide the set. Feels a bit like the stage has really affected their results. They feel a lot more confident on their stage picks currently. Let's see where they go. Dreamland. This is an interesting choice because Captain Falcon could survive longer, but he can also get edge guarded. Oh, we have a fox change. Okay. Well, this is really interesting because uh, Spacey actually really liked this stage, but then again, Captain Falcon likes this as well because they both get a lot of uh, area space to move around with their fast characters. So I think this will be very dependent on how good edge guards Fox gets. Which he got the first stock for instance. Personally don't like the shines, but it's still a part of the game, so you can use it, why don't you? Oh species up to so good. So good. She really okay, it didn't matter that time because I'm pretty sure Roostock's DI was really bad, but you should really train on doing the reverse uh, knees when edge guarding. It's easier said than done, but it's much more nicer to get a guaranteed kill than just to send the other one off the stage and force another uh, edge guard. And a brutal double shine. 
Maybe he could have survived if he reacted fast enough from getting burned by the up B, but it's not something you usually count on. You're so looking strong right now. He hasn't really won the neutral match, he has got him those shine games currently, but now he seems to be showing that he can win the neutral game as well. Running around a bit, stomping a bit. Snabby is really trying to get uh, his pace back in game right now, but Roosting is just denying it to him. Coverage those options really- Oh! We have the disrespect giant, but didn't matter because he's wide actually. Really good play by Rusuk though. He got the wall jump shine to something other stuff. Oh, nice back here. You got one laser. This is gonna be a game changer. Of course, game changer. Game um, confirmer, I guess. Oh. If he didn't get the volume there, it would actually look like he was in a bad position and might get stumped here, but that's not the case. Not sure what Snubby wanted to do, which caused him to do a non moving air dodge there. Ah, nice re grab. It's that side of me is not that far. Ah, managed to recover with, yeah, with the jab, edge core. He really wants to get here, the knee uh, side, mid side B. Oh, and the the eye from Rustag was not was not good there. Still a high percentage. Uh, Snipe really needs to get something real good going here and not get shed guard. Interesting to go for a shine game for that percent. Yeah, and he's dead. And the game goes to Rustag.